Hey everyone and welcome back. This is a tip number two. There's not a boss ahead. There are a bunch of liquors, however. Um, handgun's not going to be any help, but I'm going to take it anyway. We're taking shotgun with all the shotgun shells and a little bit of health this time. Uh, we are taking the key. We're not taking the cog. We can't actually get all the way up to where we need the cog. Um, I, I only made it through like three rooms. There's, <laughs> there's a lot of liquors. And uh, liquor spawn in this room on the way back too, and that's that's where it got me. So we can come over here, and there's a key for the parking garage in the hallway over here. We we can go grab. I'll still grab this. Take one red herb. So there's liquors in the hallway upstairs, and we can't get into that room. We don't have the crank though. Crank is the issue. And there's also liquors in here. Which, um, it's fun, fun times. I wonder if I can get both of them. Oh, liquors. Wanna, wanna team up over there in the corner so I can get both of you? See, that'd be great. Thank you. Ah, timing. Shoot him. I had to, he had to, he had to do the... What, what even is that? Pumping? It's pumping the shotgun. He had to pump the shotgun. It's fine. Uh, Marvin actually has, like, really thick thighs. So, uh, he's immune to thigh damage. Parking lot key. So we could head upstairs and fight another liquor, but I don't want to do that. Um, we can't actually do the puzzle in this room. Uh, if you walk up there, you don't fall through the floor. And you can't move these. It says you can move them, but they don't move. So, can't do that puzzle. We just have to head back. But now that we've grabbed this key, oh, maybe? Yeah, yeah, there's liquors now. Hello, liquor. Out of the way. I gotta use all my shotgun shells, unfortunately. I think there's another one over here. We're gonna, we're gonna pop down here. Uh, we can't go through the bottom way because the door is bared, bared, barred still. So we, ha we do have to go this way to get to the parking garage. But I wanted to sprint over to uh, sneak. Sprint over and then go back up and down so I can sneak back over here. I, I'm still fine. Oh, hello, looker. How's it going? Did not care about that, huh? I'm not sure if I've ever seen a looker do that. Like that animation. I never shoot him from behind. They always like flip around on me. Okay, we still have 18 shells. That should be fine, so long as more things haven't spawned. I got caught off guard by a bunch of those lookers, so it, they just kind of tore me apart. So that's why that run got thrown in the trash can. No lookers? Okay, no lookers. We, well, this, this got repopulated with zombies. Yeah, so the zombies are just still going to be in here. But I don't care about the... Like, we can't go... Wait. Do I have to go that way? It, it, it's parking lot key. Key to open the parking lot. Do I have to go this way? This is a parking lot, right? Hello, zombie. Since we're fighting liquor so much, we're probably running pretty low on the amount of zombies left. So I'm not too worried about just smacking them down with a handgun at this point. Especially if it was just the one zombie. Like, surely, um... That's why the zombies are here, right? I still crows. I don't care about the crows. Gotta hear you weird birds. Can we get through the parking garage this way? Dogs are still dead. Well, worst case, we just we waste a little bit of time and a little bit of ammo, but not anything too bad. It's not even a box out here, right? It's just the safe thing. Usually never come back here after the uh, initial trip. Okay, see, I can't open that. I do, like, run out of breath. See, I would I would count this as the parking lot. Would you not count this as the parking lot? I would count this as the parking lot. 
Maybe I'm just crazy, but I, I would think this would be the parking lot. Guess not. Because the in, like, if it's inside of a building, I would count as a parking garage. Parking lot would be an empty lot. Parking garage would be a, uh, a covered building. That That's my uh, reasoning behind this. I don't know if it's right or not, but that's my reasoning. Out of here, birds. I don't want any of it. So we'll have this room we have to go down the staircase over here. Um, but that will connect us directly to the basement. Oh, the hallway to the basement. And surely it can't be repopulated already. Granted, the windows are broken, so... Probably the most reasonable thing to be repopulated. We already opened that safe. What was even in the safe? I've forgotten. It's, it's been... Ooh, zombie. Hello. It's been a while since we've done any of this stuff. How am I waiting, zombie? Okay, he's dead. I shouldn't have ran into him. There's not even caution. Wow. Second there, I thought he died from that. I wonder if I should have checked out front to see if uh, Jimmy made it there. I guess I can check Jimmy now. Hey, Jimmy, are you in here? You're not in here. We haven't been up to the front, like... Wait, have we been in the liquor room? Like, the, the initial liquor room. Like, that hallway? Because I, I was thinking about the box behind me that needs a wire. Because I am looking for a wire for the car, right? Hmm. I don't remember if we were in there. That was that was back before my power was out for a week, so. We're now in the parking lot slash garage. And it's dogs. But that's why I do have this red green herb. That's a lot of dogs. Hold on. I got <laughs> Dogs, let me pause time so I can reload my gun. Oop, I blew a head off of one of them. I'm not, I'm not risking the knife game this time around. It, it's The whole way was a little more reasonable because, you know, they're funneled. Okay, one left. Not dead yet. There he goes. You, you can tell from the, uh, the sound effects. They had a lot of police cars in here, but it, I feel like this would be a nightmare to like pull out of. Like, like getting this this car out right here. Like, how are you gonna do that? Or even this one. Just it feels like it would be a nightmare. Okay, well we can run now all the way back upstairs now. The uh, the van is gone, but you can't go over there because there isn't. That doesn't exist in the game. There's nothing actually over there. Would've been really nice to go down that ramp, maybe. It's gonna be locked. Yeah, it's locked. So this is just a really contrived way to make me run all the way back upstairs. That's that's fine. I can do it. I can definitely do it. I mean, there shouldn't be anything between me and uh, victory right now, right? I should just be able. It should be a straight shot. No, there, there's one liquor on the balcony still. Oh, and this guy, I guess. Forgot about this guy. Later. You suck. Because I, there's not really anything between me and the, uh, the victory. I'm kind of thinking about taking the magnum with me. The only issue is once I'm down there, I don't have a way to get to uh, an item box. I may have to ignore the Magnum, just because I don't have the the room. Like I'm gonna have, I have two slots to work with by the time this is over, which isn't a lot, especially if uh, there's like any items in there. So not that, but we do need uh, this. The only issue is like I'm gonna 
I'm gonna die and then I'm gonna have to load back a thousand years. So we run around here, we go back up the, uh, or I technically go up to the stairs for the first time. <laughs> that, that one was non canon. We come through here, we go up the stairs, there's nothing in this room anymore. I checked the side wings too, there's there's still nothing there. Um, yeah. Through here and there should be one liquor. I can run by him. I can, sweet, yeah. I'm not coming back this way, I'm gonna go down the chute because that's the only way I can go. So, that's a nice little save ammo there. I may need it. Okay. That's all of that. I always felt weird to be in Resident Evil 2 where you like, you use the crank once and you ditch it. You use the cranks in RE1 so much. Yeah, I use the crank 800 times. Alright. Thank you whenever at the police station was like, why is the why is there like a door up here? <laughs> and there's the engine fuse, it's just here, yeah, I'm gonna jump down. I think I have to. Zombies. Alright. That's the prison, right? I think he's dead. Let's go ahead and get all of this nonsense ready. I'm gonna go unlock this door just in case. Hello, zombie. Fall over, please. Thank you. There's, there's zombies somewhere. I just don't. I can't see them. Marvin won't tell me. Yeah, they're they're over there. Marvin. Oh, you gotta tell me what's happening over there. What's around the corner? That was an angry man. Oh, he lunged. And he got the wall, but, you know, Marvin felt sympathy pains again. Okay, so they're all dead. Wait, is this the... No, that's the gel. Never mind, I'm an idiot. I... Yeah, I always get turned around here. Okay, so that door's now unlocked. That's dog kennel. And this is gel cell. Oh, and it's the engine cable. I always thought this was weird. This little red light says uh, the control panel to unlock the thing. It's always unlocked, like on every playthrough, so it's always weird. Like, surely I would press that, right? I wonder, because there was the whole, um, I see, this is why I didn't bring the magnum. I'd already be full. Oh, hey. Um, I'm here to rescue you. We had, uh, I'm not leaving this cell, but I'm going to leave the cell open. I'm not going anywhere. It's probably the safest place in the city. Fine, take this key. You can unlock the cell door. Just wait, you can lock the cell door. Stay cave. Oh, gee, thank you. All right, I gave him a key, I guess. I just had that. I suppose I could go use the manhole opener. Oh, there's nothing in here anyway. Isn't there usually uh, herbs in there? Anyway, it just feels weird, like, at some point, I, I feel as though this, initially, you had to press it when you first got here. Or you needed to do something. I, kn I know they scrapped a ton. When, like, they, they made an entire different version of RE2. And then they scrapped it. Hear dogs immediately. <laughs> immediately go like, oh, this is going to hurt my ribs. And uh, pry that bad boy open. To that inventory space. Can I kill the dogs through the, the gel cell? I mean, I assume if I do, I can't get in there. Ooh, but they're shotgun shells. Go ahead, dogs. Open the doors. I know you want to. There you go. Good job, dogs. Is there a reason these dogs are, like, locked in the sturdiest of cages? They look sturdy. They weren't. Come on, dogs. There we go. 
Well, that's most of my ammo, but I do have a shotgun now. I, I've had the shotgun, but I have more ammo. Also, look, it's Jojo, the dog. Rip Jojo. Also, why? There's so many dogs, but there's no actual... Uh, cage. There's only, like, three cages for the dogs. Yet there's always so many dogs. Oh, look at the giant spiders. Still as useless as ever. <laughs> they just don't get anything done, those poor spiders. Uh, I can't do anything with that. I gotta go drop my stuff off in here. Poor, poor spiders. Another blue herb. See, I'm always, uh... I always want to, like, leave herbs laying around on the off chance that... I'm gonna save, but I'm gonna pick up all the stuff first. Uh, I like leave them laying around just in case I get poisoned or something, and I'm not near a box. I don't think you can actually die from poison. I think you only go down to very like danger, but you gotta be touched by something because I never kill all the enemies in the level anyway. I probably should just keep the uh, the combo with me. Let's go ahead and save some progress. I'm gonna bet we're, this is where like boss numero uno is. Uh, so I also have uh, this old handgun for the Magnum. I don't have any extra ammo for it. Just combine those two. We'll see if we have to. Use, I don't really want to use the Magnum. I'd rather save the ammo, but. Uh, Oh, wait, it's just gonna let me up there, huh? That is locked, okay. Uh, then let's swap out to the handgun. Because, uh... It looks like I'm gonna be able to climb through that. And in that case, on the other side, it's usually dogs or zombies, so... Change plan. I mean, who knows? Time of the Tyrant could be over there. It's somehow, like, the, uh... The horror he one Tyrant. Like, how did you get here? Game. Oh, oh now here I am. And there's Magnum ammo. That kind of... That's unfortunate. Now I think it's gotta be the other way around. Uh, yeah. I, I almost had it. You know? Almost. Yeah, do you just... The, the worm thing, stay over there. Okay, they're on me now. Great, wonderful. Yeah, get them off of you. Bad. Stop it. I may run around him. I'm in caution, but I'll, I'll be fine in caution. I could maybe kill him with a handgun. Who knows? Okay, now I'm in red caution. Can I? I never really kill these things on the floor. I just always ignore them. That's fine. Good. Oh, uh, second, I got got to run over here. Marvin still has a very strong spine. Well, I I somehow sort of called the boss just down the right location. He did. Oh, sweet, he's dead. I just get the things off of me, please. Thank you. Stop it. It's me leaving. Ah, I gotta get to a door so they despawn. Man, those things hurt. I'm not in red call. I'm not in red danger, so I don't know why I'm limping like I'm in red danger. It's very unfortunate that uh, you're much, much slower in red danger, especially now that uh, the next favorite puzzle ever is here. It's the pushing box puzzle. Do you love pushing boxes? I love pushing the boxes. Push and push. To be honest, this is still better than the RE1 box puzzle that uh, you do in the Shark Lab, where you gotta like push one box all the way down the hall. Ah, uh, I'm I'm so glad that RE doesn't have box puzzles anymore. Whose idea was the box puzzle? Like I'm okay with the uh, like. 
the statue puzzle in RE1 Underground. That was a fun time. Where you had to uh, push it against the wall and then use the crank to ro or to push it out. And then you had to put it on a tile to rotate it. That was a fun time. It's a little thought-provoking. This one, though, not so much. It's just like, I, Marvin's afraid of getting a little wet. Like, what even is this room? <laughs> Like, I understand the, the other stuff because they could be put in later, but, like, what was the architecture for this room? Shove my puzzle to get to my shelf where I keep my gasoline. <laughs> Otherwise, you will never be able to leave. Alright, I need you to, to limp a little faster here. Right side of this dude's dead, so, you know, a little better. Come back out, and it's the, t it's the uh, Mr. X has shown up. Go check down here in case there's stuff. Could be stuff. Maybe. Ooh, actually, this may be the way out. <gasps> there's a first aid spray down here. Well, don't mind if I do. I still have no idea which games, like, penalize you for the first aid sprays. I think one of them does it. I don't know which one it is, though. Oh, it's the exit. Look at that. Um, it's a little faster. I don't have to go back to the sewers or anything. Oh, hello, lady. Ah, oh, you're alive. Why Why are you here? We got, why didn't you just stay out front? Don't worry, Rita. I'm sure he's fine. You can get to that truck repaired. I've got the things. Make sure you're carrying the items with you. The police station has been overrun by monsters. We won't have much time to escape, so make sure you're fully prepared. All right. Seems like a perfect time for uh, ditching this in favor of this. Well, no, what I should do is put this stuff up and I should, like. First, uh, first things first, we save, I think. Go ahead and uh, save up the old Marvin here. You can see it, it has been, you know, like 11 days, <laughs> by the way, <laughs> since the, uh, the last, last set of games. Uh, so we want to. We're gonna hold one health thing. Oh no, we have to. We can only hold one health thing, can't we? But I'd rather have the guns than um. Health, like health, is gonna help me. Why am I gonna do knife the final boss stuff? Okay, I got the things on me. I have the shotgun. Oh, and I got two minutes. <laughs> Surprise. Dogs? Yep, ignore the dogs. Not not time for you dogs. I've unlocked it. Unfortunately, the door is barricaded, so it's going to be a little hard to get to the front. Hello, zombies. Out of my way. I got places to be. Second zombie also places to be. Rita's fine, I'm, I'm sure. Watch out, there's more zombies. Wow, there are a lot of zombies, huh? I got him in like the legs, but that's fine. I keep trying to do the the headshot thing. I just don't have enough. I don't give Marvin the time to actually raise it all the way because I don't care about them dying. Okay, we. Yeah, that's not good. Okay, uh, <laughs> that's that's their sweet insta kill move if you're on low health. I hate that. Yeah, you can you can try and play with the birds. I'm gonna be leaving though. It's very unfortunate we have to do this roundabout way, but it's what we gotta do? We gotta do this. We gotta go um, down the hall. Let go of me. Yep. That's what? Oh, she immediately freed me, and there's another guy at the door. Not sure if I've ever seen a guy at the door. Uh, I'm still fine though. I could probably swap out and get a little bit of um, health here, like one health by eating the herb, but I'm gonna ignore it. Oh, zombies, hello. The the unfortunate thing <laughs> is it takes time to pump the shotgun. Out of my way. If, if I had a faster shotgun, I'd probably be better. I think I'm gonna make it, I got, why do we have um, two minutes to escape, by the way. Ah, wait, zombies! 
probably chunk it through too much health, to be honest. That's, that worked. Go in front of the door, and I'm here. 30 seconds to spare. They're quick. They, I can't pour the gas fast enough. Hello? Game? Did we do it? Oh, maybe. Jimmy's in the driver's seat. Come on, get in. Jimmy number two was here. I don't know where he came from. Is this everyone? What about Marvin? Yes! That's a good question. What about Marvin? Move. Go, go, go. Marvin! Don't worry about me. Just get going. No way. I'm not leaving you behind. I got there's one zombie outside the window. Oh, It was one zombie. Never even used the Magnum. You don't need to worry about him, Rita. He was born to be a cop. It'll take a lot more than that to stop a tough guy like him. Ah, yes. I'm sure he's fine. We haven't even finished training the new recruits yet. Right, Marvin? Man, I sure do wish Outbreak wasn't like the worst game to try and get running. <laughs> I'm not dead yet. <sighs> Just use a little bit of that first aid spray. All you had to do was wait for Marvin. How rude. Just left him. And they went off to some hospital, I'm sure. Had to fight hunters. Ugh. Well, that was pretty good. I enjoyed that. That was a fun time. I always love RE mods when they're not, you know, murderously hard. <laughs> this was not that. There, there was, there was room for mistakes, and I love that because I need room for mistakes all the time. Do kind of wish I could have used the Magnum a little bit, though. I don't know. I was, I was expecting there to be. A, a Mr. X somewhere, and I was like, yeah, that's who I'm going to use it for. Because, um, Birkin is pretty slow early on. He can be shotgunned and whatnot. Mr. X, though, he needs the Magnum. Oh, look. A rank. I was, I was thinking F. <laughs> Still time, an hour and 19 minutes. See, in RE2, is there an S rank? I, I know it's it's so weird with the rankings in um, the, the early RE games where it's like your time, your saves, whether you used uh, first aid sprays. I got the, the rocket launcher. Um, I don't think I need that, unfortunately. <laughs> it's a fun weapon, though. I never really play games on like New Game Plus with the uh, the broken weapons. I don't know, it just it's not something I I find fun. I like I like the challenge of it all. Do not load. <laughs> all right, I'm kind of curious what you what happens. I assume the game just crashes. Uh, you can play Heart Scenario. Why do you like? What do you mean by this? See, this is the weird menu. Like, there's a bunch of fake areas. It just says mode. Oh, wait, there's a hard down. Wait, I can go down? This is me pressing left and right, by the way. How does this one start? Did we ever save Jimmy number two? Or Jimmy number three? Whichever, the one in the, uh, the safe, the, uh, the napping room, whatever that's called. Yeah, we'll skip that. So, hard mode, I take it's just less ammo, maybe? I mean, this ammo's still here. It's 20 bullets. Was it 20 bullets before? Was it less ammo before? And it's just, there's zombies out here. 
door won't turn. It seems to be still coming inside. I mean, she's she's lining that guy up. Maybe the zombies just have way more health now. Because this is... <laughs> how is he not dead yet? She, she, like, smacked that guy with about a million rounds. You know, well... <laughs> she's still, like, the best companion ever. It's too bad we didn't, like, she wasn't with us for, like, the last 45 minutes. It's only the first little chunk. She's, she's just so good at her job. She's dedicated. Like, I didn't even know you could do that. How did you manage to blow off, like, one and a half legs? That is really impressive. Oh, man. Yeah, I assume, like, maybe zombies have more health, maybe? That or there's less items. I'm not sure if you can, uh, change, like, layout and stuff. The only thing I know changes is, uh, like, in a range mode or whatever, in the original one, you just get a machine gun. How are you so good at blowing legs off? I didn't even know that was an option. Yep. Watching that guy. <laughs> She's just... <laughs> just mashing through legs. She will not stop the leg destruction. Can I? Can I blow through legs? I've never tried that. It doesn't seem like it. It seems like I just... Oh, wait. No, there goes a leg. Like, I didn't even have an arm. Can I... There, there's no zombies over here for me to check. I was gonna, like, just shoot a regular zombie. Oh, well. Uh, there wasn't anything in here, right? I mean, there there wasn't zombies is what I'm trying to get at. But there is a uh, cabinet key. Okay, yeah. So, I think the, uh, the, the progression is probably all the same, so... Probably won't be doing a, a hard playthrough anytime soon. Normal playthrough was real fun, though. Very much so enjoyed it. Now we need a, um... Carlos mod, I guess? We've got Barry's mod. we got Marvin's mod. What is... I don't know if we want to do Carlos. Who would, who would it be for Resident Evil 3? It'd be like, uh... Uh, it, it's not Nikolai. I don't think he'd be Nikolai because that's the bad guy. What was, what was the injured guy on the train who blows himself up? Maybe that guy. We need we, we need a that guy mod. <laughs> Whatever that is. 